ever pondered over who would triumph in a clash between a cheetah and a crocodile? Two apex predators from different realms, each with their unique set of skills. The cheetah, the fastest land animal, and the crocodile, a prehistoric beast with a deadly bite. Imagine the setting, the African savanna, where the cheetah reigns supreme, and the water's edge, the crocodile's hunting ground. The cheetah, sleek and agile, its sharp eyes scanning the terrain for potential prey. The crocodile lurking silently beneath the water, its formidable jaws ready to snap shut at a moment's notice. The cheetah, known for its exceptional speed and agility, would likely strike first. It would use its acceleration, reaching speeds of up to 60 miles per hour in a matter of seconds, to launch an attack. Its strategy would involve speed, surprise, and precision. A swift swipe of its paw, a bite to the neck, the cheetah's moves are deadly and quick. Meanwhile, the crocodile, a creature of patience and power, would wait for the perfect moment. Its strategy would involve stealth and strength. It would stay hidden beneath the water's surface, its eyes and nostrils the only visible signs of its presence. Then in a flash, it would lunge out of the water, its jaws snapping shut with a force of nearly 2,000 pounds per square inch, enough to crush bone. Yet the fight wouldn't be straightforward. The cheetah, while fast and agile, lacks the stamina for prolonged battles. Its speed is its strength, but also its weakness. On the other hand, the crocodile, while powerful and durable, is significantly slower on land. Its strength lies in the water, its movements more sluggish on dry land. So who would emerge victorious in this hypothetical battle? It's a question of contrasting strengths and weaknesses, of land versus water, speed versus power. The conclusion, if the battle takes place on land, the advantage would likely lie with the cheetah, with its superior speed and agility. But if the fight moves to the water, the crocodile, with its stealth and strength, would likely have the upper hand. In the end, it all comes down to the setting and the strategies employed by these two fascinating creatures. It's a reminder of the incredible diversity and adaptability of the animal kingdom, where each creature is perfectly adapted to its environment and survival is the ultimate goal.